Good afternoon, this is Chris with Mobile Click, and today we wanted to put together a quick instructional video on how to use a signature file with your QR code in Gmail. We've had a lot of requests for this. Uh, Gmail has actually made it a little bit easier uh, for uploading images, but we also have included a uh, URL link for uh, other environments where you have to uh, point to the image rather than actually being able to upload it. But uh, here we go. The uh, first thing that you need to do is uh, log in to your MobileClick account. And then navigate to Manage Cards. Now what you're going to see here is something new in our control panel. Oops, wrong tool. Let me point that out to you here. Which is these long codes. These are new here. And if you need to point to the image, we are now hosting your QR code on the internet. If you go to that link, that is your unique QR code. So in some instances, you're not allowed to upload an image, but you could point to it. Just cut, copy, and paste this particular code into your environment, and then you could use it uh, in another, uh, another instance. So that is my, and everybody has a very unique number here, so nobody points in anybody else's code, a highly secure code for your individual QR code. So that is available to you. However, in this case, we're going to do it the easy way, and we are going to download your QR code. So here's my image, and that image is now downloaded to my desk here. And I'm going to save that in an easy manner. So you can see that to uh, my computer. Uh, let's see, I'll just put it in my C file, and I'm going to call it an easy name here, me, and jpeg to make it simple so I know where to upload it from okay now we have our QR code in a downloaded to our computer I am then going to navigate to Gmail now this is where it gets a little bit tricky I'm not a big Gmail user um, but this is what I found was the big error is enabling uh, what they call a canned response and images so click here in the upper right hand corner and that is for the options and go to mail settings when you do that, you'll open up to this page, and what you need to do is go to the Labs section. Click on Gmail Labs here, and then you're going to navigate down, and you need to find, oh, see, they did change orders here. We need to find Enable Canned Images, and it was kind of at the bottom, and Insert Images. So we need this to enable inserting images. We want to make sure that that is enabled. I'm look, here it is, enable canned responses. So you have to navigate and find those. So once you have that those two things are enabled, then go to save changes. Okay. Now that that's done, now you have to create your signature file or your canned response. And this is actually quite easy. Go to compose mail and just go right into the body of the email and say this is going to be your actual signature file Chris Terry and I have my phone number 561-555-1212 mobile click support and now I want to be able to add my QR code we go up here to insert image and in this case we have the two options we have use web address or upload image from the computer. We're going to use upload image. Navigate to my computer, to the C drive, and I called it me. I just made it short. There's my image. I'll save that. You'll see that pop up and hit OK. Now there is your signature file with a QR code. Next step is to basically save it and say save new canned response and we're going to call it my new sig file and hit OK. We'll send ourselves a message well, from 
Google and send. So that message has gone out and when I open that I'll have my nice sig file which we'll do here in a second. We will go once again to compose mail to anyone at did it work message and then I'm going to say oh I want to put my signature file. You go to canned responses go to my new sig file was the one that we just created and there it is and you've got your signature file. We hope you found this useful. Thanks for being part of MobileClick. Have a great day.